Okay, so I've already did some pre-prep. Um, I have um, Brussels sprouts that I've cut in half. This is probably about three pounds of Brussels sprouts. These are leftover stems and pieces from um, my mushrooms. I'm adding them in here. I am going to be sauteing this over medium heat. I'm going to cook them nah, al dente. So of course we're going to go ahead and get started and get them going for us. Now to, to add an extra flavor to this, I'm gonna use some Tony um, Creole seasoning mix with this. And we're just gonna spread some in there. Just a little bit of salt. I'm using Himalayan. And we're going to begin to saute this mix. Now, of course, while you're waiting for this to get started, I have a package of brie cheese. This is a soft cheese. And of course, before we begin, we want to peel off the rind. This is going to be our topping for our mixture here, okay? Okay, so I want you to notice as it cooks up, it gets this bright, beautiful green color. Um, when the inner portion is almost soft, then we're ready for step two. Okay, so it's cooked till it's slightly soft. Just slight firmness in the middle. Now I'm going to transfer this over and I have a waiting pan and I'm going to transfer every, everything in here. Just gonna clean this pan out. And I'm going to saute um, some walnuts to go with this one, okay? So we're going to quickly clean this pan out. Pan warm again, slightly oiled. And I'm going to put in probably about a cup of walnuts. And we're just going to saute these guys. On go the walnuts. Now the brie is a soft cheese. It's usually come coated. I've just simply removed the layer. I'm going to remove this one and then we're going to apply it. Now the brie will melt really well on top of this, giving it a beautiful crust. And of course, I'm just going to spread this out across the top. And we're going to bake this for probably another 15 minutes. And I'll show you what it looked like at the end. This is our finished result. Beautiful, nice pieces of cranberries. Nice, soft, al dente. Broccoli pieces of mushrooms, nice crunchy walnuts, and of course our brie cheese mixed up in there.